howdy, howdy. Wait, man. Other way, bro. First car of the morning. <laughs> hey, you can only approve from here, right? <laughs> So we're going to start in on these cars right here. Cadillac, of course, Nissan Frontier action, um, minivan, Mount Impala, pretty much your standard little deal. Little S10. Pick up truck. Regular old junk. I guess you could say the Suzuki's the oddball of the batch. I get it to sit up there nice and easy. which is my favorite part the crunching of the metal or the windows popping um, it all excites me Raymond over to take care of them vines when we first showed up this whole fence line was covered with them vines they've been working on a couple days cool 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 so my next move will probably be the, was that it, Envoy, Equinox, whatever on top, that minivan, this other minivan. Maybe I ought to put the S10 in between the two minivans. That might be the best solution. This isn't gonna be too long of a video. I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna crush a few cars, <clears throat> excuse me, and then I'm gonna let Compadre get up here in the loader. Let him bust some down. We don't got too much going on. So I mean yeah, we got some work to do, we got loads, but it's a good it's a it's a good opportunity to let him get some more loader time. Good opportunity. Man, we say we... I got, I got a hammer down on rule number one because I'm going to let him go over there and, and pick his bundles and put it together. You know? And... Rule number one, I gotta get him touching them cars. I gotta get him touching those cars. You start that off as like a day one habit. 
keep everybody safe. Well, isn't this a cute little car? I heard something about Samsung was trying to make a car or something like that. Look, somebody, they popped the fender or they popped the bumper. They took some seat metal screws. Why can't I zoom with my phone? Huh? <laughs> get her done. Get us back on the road, Bubba. Huh? Gotta get these kids to school. We got honeys to go pick up. Hey, we probably gotta move the rack. For the Tijeras. You think? Come on. these Cadillac roofs will tear. We hit a big bump. They'll just rip out. Honda, Honda does it too. But generally, it, this is a pretty solid place to pick up the cars. A uh, lot stronger than when I first got in the business, I was amazed at how you could just pick them cars up one fork right there in the roof. Just a few more days. I mean, are we down to single digits? It's got to be nine. I mean, if yesterday or the other day was ten, eight days, the Cowboys on the road. I'm kind of worried about my phone service because I know when I go up to Arkansas, I lose signal a lot. But I'm muddy feet saying, you know, we'll just hot spot off of his deal. And then um, hopefully we can do some lives out on the road and you folks can see other parts of America that, um, you know, on my channel you wouldn't, I mean, surely you can go somewhere else and see it if you want, but anyway, I'm sure we're going to do some lives on the road. It's just going to be a blast. Got aluminum wheels in there. I won't tell him my plan and then, uh, oh, come on, cowboy. Man, I should have caught it when it was bouncing in the air. That's what I should have done. That would have been cool. So, uh, me and Miss Liz, the lady that makes my merchandise, or the merchandise for Cowboy Card Crushing Channel, um, we had a weight loss channel, a challenge. Miss Liz got sick and she didn't feel good for like at least a week and a half. And she asked and she said, God, you know, John, can we please just have like an official start over? I feel better. I mean, her, even her kid was, um, didn't feel good for a little while. And um, 
So we, I agreed that we'll have it, you know, because I, I needed my, I need my truck washed, you know. <laughs> I need my truck washed. So I think that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna, I'm gonna bust down that minivan or whatever that is on top on the right. Then we'll pop this um, minivan here, put it on the bottom, and bust that S10 down. You have to close the door or he won't be able to get the he won't be able to get all the, the lug nuts are covered by the door. Give it up. Just give it up. Give it up. Just give it up. Jammer in there. Oh, there's a wheel. after lunch and um, that, that's when it's pretty hot <laughs> <laughs> no but I guess me and Miss Liz will do another way in this weekend or um, she, she wants to start over I think I should get, get half the truck washed, then we'll do a start up. <laughs> At least get the get half of it washed. No, but if I keep staying down here on the ground. I should, I mean, in theory, right? Watch what I eat and do all this extra work down on the ground. I should lose some pounds. But I sure do drink like 10 or 12 waters a day, so I don't know how much ground I'm gonna be gaining, but.
I caught one little bitty bass yesterday. Hey, Compadre's down. He's like, Cowboy, you want to go fishing? That's fine, man. He's cool. Same routine, my Mario. Run up there to the gas station, get some tacos, go back to the fishing hole for 35, 40 minutes. I mean, you know. Talk about a great day. Crush some cars and catch a bass. Dang. Then you pick up your kids and find out both of them did the good in school and came home with gold stars. Huh? About perfect day. I say we give Miss Liz a, a, a fresh start over. That's it, real deal, real deal. It's on. She's single mom, and also she's taking care of her mom. But by God, a deal is a deal. <laughs> we'll, we'll give her a deal over. to be all like that, S10. Jeez, Bubba. But that's the way you want it. That's the way you get it. Hey, he's over there fidgeting with the cat cutter, the catalytic converter cutter. I see him jiggling wires and pushing buttons. Good gosh. We ain't used one in... What, three weeks? We ain't been crushing nothing but shells. Hey, que paso? Is work or no? Whoa, whoa, god dang what just flew in. Oh, heck. Wait till y'all see this thing. Wait till y'all see this thing. This is a cicada. This is, a, this is that bug that makes um, them, that noise in the summertime, that, that buzzing sound. And um, good luck, Bubba. <laughs> he flew right in, smashed into the window, hit the floor. <laughs> also, you'll see him leave um, like the hole. Like, I think they call it the exoskeleton when they, um, I don't know if it's a molt, but when, you know, when they move, how insects do it, how they go from pupa, larva, I think I'm missing one there. Anyway, it's, it's, it will become something else. Or no, that's what it became. It came out of the ground, hatched out, and that's... Y'all just want to talk about drunk and crushing cars. That's what I talk about best. 
don't think y'all can see. I'm gonna try to pop that catalytic converter off the back of the motor. There we go. Hang on, let me hold on to it, man. It's wobbling. There you go, Bubba. thousands of these. Hey compadre, watch your leg. Thanks. I wouldn't have said nothing. He probably wouldn't have looked and then he wouldn't have got none of that glass in his face. Uh oh. What you got? What you got? What you got? What you got? Looks like a bunch of kids. Oh, we crushed a big old robot. I know, but my kid got too many toys, man. It's too much. It's too. It's too much, man. Y'all don't call me a bad daddy. That, them kids got all they need. I mean, and plus. So I'm trying to sign um, my daughter up for archery and we don't have any equipment and so I went by the local you know we got everything stored and um, they, they did have some archery equipment but I wanted to look I wanted to look elsewhere but I still had to buy stuff like you can't take two kids to the store with you like tonight I'm going to go to a sporting goods store last night I went to a store that has a sporting goods section Somehow I couldn't keep my kids out of the other sections. <laughs> well, God dang. There's some toys that fell out. I think I seen a little dinosaur. Cowboy Junior loves dinosaur. I'm a sucker daddy. I can't help it. No, but I mean, I'm teaching them right. All right, so he got a dinosaur and a little Spider-Man. <laughs> Folks, I hope y'all have a great day. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put him in the loader. He's worried about he's worried about um, like breaking off catalytic converters and stuff like that. But when we come to it, 
I'll coach him, you know? From I'll stand up here on the loader with him and I'll coach him. Or I'll go down there on the ground and point it out to him. I mean you gotta you gotta there has to be some kind of pressure applied. Not a lot, but some kind of pressure. Just like just like raising them kids. Pressure makes diamonds. Y'all be careful, be kind. Thank ya.